free Las Vegas Sun High School Football Media Day at Red Rock Resort. We want to thank our host, of course, alongside our sponsors, including New World Graphics, Friends Don't Let Friends Wear Blank T-Shirts, and Dom DeMarco's Pizza. The next team we have with us here at Red Rock are the Durango High Trailblazers. We have Coach Robert Cutts alongside a pair of seniors, Tyler Paul and Chris Rodriguez. Uh, Coach, I know we've seen you around town before, but you're taking over the Durango program. You know, it was uh, it was time for me to get back in the saddle again. Um, spent the last four years with uh, Marcus over at Spring Valley and kind of got my confidence back and figured out some things. You know, um, my first stint at El Dorado as the head coach, I, I was just young and uh, didn't know everything. Didn't know everything I thought I did. So, um, but now I'm here. I've got that uh, extra experience under my belt, and, and I'm, I'm really. Really, really glad to be here. Um, what are some of the biggest things you learned as a head coach before that you both uh, implemented? You know, um, it's just like managing uh, expectations, I guess, is, is one of them. Um, you know, making sure that what you do fits your athletes. And, and honestly, you know, having that relationship with your athletes that, you know, you know how to communicate with them, you know how they best succeed. Um, I, I think that was the biggest thing. Um, Chris, what's it been like uh, working with You know, obviously, you know, it's it tough starting with a new team, but I feel like he's done a great job. But, you know, our motto, like, setting a standard and changing the culture. So I feel like he's implemented that good like, you know, side of a, what a program should be like. Uh, Tyler, what do you think is going to be some of the strengths? Um, I would say off offensively, uh, we're still a spread team. I feel like we can uh, definitely air it out. And I feel like on the defensive side, we're, we can dominate on the ground and in, and in the air. Well, part of it is a you know a tiger doesn't change the stripes. I've been a spread guy my entire life, and um, these guys were really successful in the spread the last few years. Uh, I'm just coming in and putting my little wrinkle on it and using uh, some H back, using some tight ends, things they haven't done in the past. Um, that are really taking us to the next level offensively. Um, Tyler, uh, the realignment is a hot topic with uh, every team. I know you guys uh, will be facing some different opponents. Uh, it's kind of one of the upper levels this year. What do you think of where you guys fall and uh, kind of uh, do well? Um, I think we're all excited because, uh, you know, there's no gimmies this year. You know, everything's going to be competitive. So I think we're all excited to have really uh, close games, have uh, really great opponents, to make us better, and uh, overall we'll be fun. Um, Chris, we got into some of the specifics offensively. What about defensively? Uh, what are uh, what kind of differences? Um, we're really a you know, run defense based kind of you know, scheme. So you know we we're blessed enough to grab the defensive coordinator from Shadow Rays, Coach Rapp, who obviously had a great success over there going to two state um, games. So I mean, I feel like we're going to be able to shut down the run and, and the pass game. You know, make a lot of turnovers. So it, is it all about the physicality, or how are you guys? Uh, what are some of the traits that's going to make you win this battle? I mean, uh, our linebackers are, yeah, I feel like we have some of the best linebackers in this 5A, 2, whatever it is. So I think that our physicality is really going to bring out the best uh, opponents, and I think we can match up great with that. Coach Chris and Tyler have done something right to be sitting here uh, next to you. Uh, tell us about what they're going to be to your team and maybe uh, a couple other guys who will be out there. Well, you know, when I, when I got the job, um, there was a handful of guys that reached out to me immediately. Like, when are we starting? What are we doing? Blah, blah, blah. And these were two of those guys. Um, Tyler, Tyler, the best thing about Tyler is, is when you tell Tyler he can't do something, he will do everything in his power to prove you wrong. And, and you can't teach that in kids anymore. You know, uh, Chris, Chris brings a maturity to our defense. He's that defensive leader. He knows where everyone's supposed to be, and he's not afraid to tell them when they're wrong. And then you get their their act straight. Um, we'll go to Tyler for the final word. Uh, Tyler, what are the keys to uh, taking you guys to where you want to be? Um, I feel like as a team, we just need to uh, come closer together. You know, we uh, we need good communication, and we feel like we need to make almost like a family system. Like, there's a uh, you know, there's some people that aren't really buying in. I feel like we buy into the system that we're trying to make here. I feel like we can go really far. All right. Well, it's a new era at Durango. Uh, we thank them for joining us here at the. Las Vegas Sun.